Hello YouTube, been a while. Um, <laughs> as a matter of fact, it's been a, quite a bit since my last update, but um, been busy with college, you know, finishing up the courses, getting my degree. Um, be finished real soon, and as soon as I finish, I'm going to probably start on a 125 gallon tank. Uh, along with the 125 gallon, I'll probably chronicle the building of the stand because I'm going to make my own stand, so stay tuned for that. Uh, as far as the updates go for the 75 gallon, as you can see, the anemone has stayed in that corner exactly where I wanted it to stay. That's been going real well, uh, even though the clownfish, which I now have two pair, of clowns in here none of them have actually gone into the anemone you know so pff, oh well we'll wait and see got the two uh, orange and the two black anemones I'm sorry the uh, two black clownfish everyone else has been doing good man the uh, copper band butterfly just as healthy as she wants to be the yellow tang beautiful of course, there's Virgil, the yellow-eyed coal. He's he's had his his <laughs> his ins and outs with injuries, trying to take control back of the tank, and I don't think that joker will ever learn. But um, treating the tank with garlic extreme seems to have helped as far as healing up his his uh, inju injuries. A um, couple of things have happened in the tank. We've had uh, a few more deaths. You know, I, I don't know. I don't have much luck with inverts and, and, and crabs, you know, things of that sort. But my two emerald crabs have, have expired. Both of them within weeks of each other within the month of October, which is this month. Um, of course, I'll go back and I'll probably get about two more, put them in the tank. Even though it's said that they live one to two years, you know, mine lasted about four and five months collectively. So we'll see how that goes. We'll go back out, get a couple more, put them back into the display. Um, once I'm done with all my studies and really start concentrating on another tank, I'm going to take basically everything out of this tank the rock that I have which is about a hundred pounds and I'll incorporate it into the new build because actually I want to go a little bit bigger uh, I've got seven fish in here now and my bio load hasn't been that bad um, as a matter of fact it's been as well as can be expected but I'd like to add more fish you know maybe one or two more tangs I know that's pushing it and some chromises and you know a few more things but we'll see how that goes within the coming months so this is Testarossa 101 with a quick update of the 75 gallon tank and once I get started on the 125 I'll start posting more videos so I'm gonna disappear for about another minute or so but when I come back be ready be ready to subscribe be ready to follow. Okay? Testarossa 101, signing out.